Um, I don't even know where to begin. Hello you guys and welcome back to my channel. It has been so long since I've uploaded a video. I'm actually kind of nervous. I feel like maybe I forgot how to talk to you guys on camera. It has been nine months since I've uploaded a video and so whew, I'm super excited to be back on YouTube you guys. I miss you all so much. Um, I've had a lot of changes. Um, I've gone through a lot of different things. I don't want to get too far into it but just know I've missed you guys and I'm so excited to get back on YouTube and start DIYing and Dollar Tree shopping and um, doing a haul for you guys and that's exactly what I have for you guys today is a Dollar Tree haul. Um, although I don't want to talk a whole lot about what I've been up to for the past nine months, if you guys have any questions, hit me up in the comment section. I'll answer any questions you have because um, it's really been a long time since I've seen a lot of you guys or talk to a lot of you guys, so just know all my old subscribers, I have not forgotten about you, I miss you, I love you, thank you so much for tuning in, I appreciate it so much. Yeah, a lot of things are, are different. Um, I'm in a new place, so this is where I'm going to be filming until I kind of settle in and find a better spot to film. The lighting's kind of off, it's all a little weird, but this is the best place I have to film, so we're just going to go with it and yeah. We're just going to go with it. Alright, so I have a Dollar Tree haul. Um, I'm just going to go ahead. A lot of this stuff you guys have probably already seen. Um, I needed to go get some stuff for my girls' and my son's Valentine's baskets because I really want to make them some Valentine's baskets. And you guys, I am so late this year. So far behind. Um, I really have some catching up to do. So I'm going to be showing you some Valentine's stuff and then I'm also going to be showing you just some random stuff that I'm going to be putting in their baskets. Um, but first I'm going to go ahead and show you the food items. We'll get those out of the way. Um, oops. So I thought this was a great deal. Um, this is a family size Cheerios. Um, it's the pumpkin spice Cheerios and I actually really like these Cheerios. Um, I think they're a lot better than normal Cheerios, and yeah, I just thought it was a good deal. This is one pound, 3.8 ounces. So I picked two of these up, because for a dollar, you really can't beat it. Plus, um, you got your box top, so that's always helpful for my girls at their school. They had the smaller boxes, but definitely go with the family size if there is, because you're just going to get... A better bang for your buck. So I also found these mug treats. Now my girls love these mug treats. Um, this is the rainbow chip cake with rainbow chip frosting. I thought that was really fun. You only get one individual serving in this package. So if you guys know if this is a good deal or not, let me know in the comment section because Usually when you go to Walmart and you buy them, you get two in a package, but I cannot remember how much they are. So let me know if you guys know. Um, either way, my girls love them, so I picked up a couple of these. Alright, another thing that I picked up is the Sun Best, these pastry crisps, the mixed berry. Um, you get eight of these crisps in a box. Um, I feel like that's a pretty good deal. My daughter does love these. She does love these. Did that even make sense? Anyways... She loves these. So I got a couple of boxes of these. Okay. And I, I, I guess that's really all the food items except I did get some like Valentine's candy because I'm going to be using that to fill, um, to fill in their baskets. So of course I got these cookies and cream hearts by Palmer's because I love cookies and cream chocolate and I know my girls do so and the best thing about it is that if they don't eat them I get to eat them um, so I got the cookies and cream and then I also got just these regular fudge this one I feel like is new and that is a catacorn if I am correct um, it says that you're meow meowgical meowgical you're magical I'm, I'm assuming and then I saw these which I thought were really fun um, so these are the So Sour You'll Cry Sour Pacifier Pops. So those look pretty cool. They're, they're pretty big, actually. Um, I don't know how sour they are, but they are not recommended for children under three. Um, this one is, whoop, 
flavor is this? Weird. Oh, so the red one is strawberry. The blue one is blue raspberry. And this pink pop is watermelon. That will probably be my favorite. I might give it a try. See how sour it really Those is. Are just some fillers to put in their baskets because I do plan on getting them other things that are not from Dollar Tree. Um, but I did find these little unicorn lip glosses and I just think they're adorable. I remember I got these for my girls last year as well. Um, and I, if I remember, I actually got them the same one and I remember they would be like, no, this one's mine. No, this one's mine. No, that one's mine. And so this time I decided to get a little bit different. So this one has a gold horn and then the purple hair. This one has a silver horn and pink hair. So I thought those were really cute. Okay. So I got, um, this one is going to be actually for a friend. You guys, I absolutely love this Valentine's card. I think it is so cute. It says, I love you more than coffee, sleep, bacon, binge watching TV. So that one's going to be for my friend. Again, I'm sure you guys have seen all the Valentine's stuff. I am so late this year. Um, but I've had a lot going on. Like I said, I got into a new place. I've just, I've just had a lot going on. Um, so for my man on Valentine's Day, that one's cute. That one's actually a manly Valentine. So that is nice because sometimes you can't find anything for a for boys or men so it makes it a little bit complicated um and I thought this one was so cute it says you oh <laughs> for my sweet daughter and then it has these two lollipop hearts and the inside it says daughter you hold a special place in my heart I hope you know how very how much you are loved today and always happy valentine's day with love I just really thought that was cute. And these little hearts actually stick up and the bow is adorable. So I got that. And then this one I got because it kind of reminded me of the candy theme with the little conversation hearts. This one says, love you cutie. And the inside says, wishing you a sweet Valentine's Day. So I thought that was cute. That's gonna be for my other daughter. All right, where am I at? <laughs> okay, so I did hurry and pick these up. Um, just to kind of have, um, so my girls have some options. Um, I'm probably going to need to go get more than this. I don't know if this is necessarily going to be enough for them and their classmates. But this is the Shopkins. You get 16 Valentines with 16 erasers. And I don't know why, but my oldest daughter is obsessed with erasers. She has a collection of so many different erasers. But, I mean, they're cute erasers, don't get me wrong. But she just loves, she loves stuff like that. So I thought these would be perfect for her. And then here are some of the different Valentines that you get. So if your little girl likes erasers or Shopkins, these are perfect. Then I also got these Monster High. Now, we're not so much fans of Monster Highs as we used to be. Uh, my daughter used to love, love Monster High. Wow, I can't even talk. Um, used to watch it a lot. We don't really anymore, but I thought it was cool. It comes with 16 little pins that you can put... Um, either on your shirt, your backpack. So I thought that would be really fun. And then here, I think these are adorable. Here are some of the Valentines that you get. I thought those were fun. And then also, you know, every little girl loves LOLs. So these are a must. You have to have the little LOLs. Um, so I thought these were cute. These are actually, they don't really come with anything. They don't come with any candy or erasers or pins or anything like that. But you get 32 in here, which is um, kind of a good deal. Uh, 32 should be enough to cover a class. Um, also, I found these at Walmart, and they were 220. I'm gonna say 224, 228. So if you see these at the Dollar Tree, I would recommend picking them up because they're gonna be a better deal. I found these. These are so adorable, you guys. Um, these are the squishy toys. I love them. They are so cute. I thought those would be perfect for their baskets. And you can see that they did have different styles. Um, the colors are a little bit different. So I thought those were really fun. And then I found some more squishy stuff. I did not find the squeezables or the squashables, but whatever they're called. But I did find more squishy toys. Um, 
if you find these at Walmart, um, they might be a little bit bigger at Walmart, but I know ones just like this are anywhere from 3 to $5. So if you see these at the Dollar Tree and your kids love this kind of stuff, I would really recommend picking it up. You can see here that this one is a strawberry. And then we got a banana. And this one's actually kind of big, so that one's nice. Sorry, I'm making a bunch of noise, but... And then they had these different ones. So these have little foam balls in them. They're still, they're calling them squishy toys. Um, but look how cute this little penguin guy is. I think he is absolutely adorable. I think those are so much fun, you guys. So they had a blue penguin. They had a pink penguin. And then they had a purple, I'm gonna say it's a dolphin, a purple dolphin. So I know my kids are going to love these. I'm going to put these in their baskets. Those are going to be great. And then I couldn't leave without picking up some adorable socks, you guys. I had to have these socks. So I love this one. I love the avocado. It's missing its pit. Um, and it says, be mine. Oh, I think that is so cute. Um, this one I just thought was cute because it says, I llama you. And the llama is a little furry. I think those are adorable. And then I got these long ones. They're like the knee-high ones, but I just cannot get over this cute little raccoon. I don't know what it is about raccoons, but I think they're so adorable. And the hearts, and I just love the colors together. I think that they're, I might even keep these. We'll see. Okay, and then I had to get some more of these socks. Um, I know I have some more somewhere else, but you guys, look how cute these are. These are little cows and they have little ears. So adorable, you guys. I love these socks. And then they also have little mice with the cute little ears. And I don't know where all the other ones went, but I would not be surprised if my kids have already came down and raided my bags. <laughs> so that's probably what happened. Um, I, I had picked up more. They had a bunch of different kinds. I wish I had a picture to show you guys, but they had a bunch of different kinds. Sorry, let me flip that around. Um, I can't even remember, but I know I grabbed like four of these, so I'm not sure where the other ones went, but yeah, those are all of the socks that I got. And then you guys, I had to pick these up because I think they're going to be great for crafting or DIYing. Um, this is a treat bag. It is like a burlap treat bag. It has a red heart on it and you actually get three in a pack. So I thought those were really cute. I did get a couple more toys. Um, these are the blind bags for the their Barbie blind bags. And these are the career mini dolls. So it says you can be anything. And then here are all of the ones that you can get. Um, my girls love anything blind bags, so I just picked these up, like I said, as fillers for their basket. And then I thought these were really cute. Um, how they had them displayed at the Dollar Tree was, was really cute. Um, it was a Ghostbusters display, and it was actually, they're calling it Ghostbuster Slime, I guess, but you can see here that it has the little guy from Ghostbusters, and I think that says Ectoplasm. But you can see it has some of the little monsters or characters or ghosts from Ghostbusters. So I thought that was cute. And yeah, it's just Ghostbuster slime. So yeah, you guys, that is everything for this haul. I hope that you enjoyed. Like I said, um, I just wanted to get some things for my girls' and my son's um, Easter. My, my girls' and my son's Valentine's baskets this year. Um, so that is everything I got. Not a whole lot of new and exciting things, I don't think, but um, I just wanted to get on here, see you guys, talk to you guys, and share a haul with you guys. Please comment me in the comment section. It would be so nice to talk to you guys again. Like I said, it's been so long. I do plan on having another video out soon. Uh, maybe we can do like a chit chat video. I can sit down and kind of explain what's going on in my life. Um, I probably won't get into too, too much detail, but... I do want to let you guys know what I've been up to and let you guys know that I've missed you and I'm so happy to be back. Thank you for still supporting my channel and coming back and watching my videos. You guys mean the world to me. If no one has told you they love you today, guys, I do. Bye.